Bam! The Triple Alliance. So it sounds like there's three people in this alliance, like there are in this group. Like me, Alyssa Dwell. And myself, Destiny Moore. And I, Timothy Smith. So who was in this alliance, you guys? Well, once upon a time, there are three nations felt threatened by the older, already existing nations, and they decided to form an alliance. These people were Germany, Austria, Hungary, and Italy, and they formed this alliance in May of 1882. Uh, so, what were like the reasons to even ally. I mean, like, why did these countries even come together? Well, Germany was a new empire, so they felt a little threatened by the older, already existing neighboring empires. So, in order to avoid a war on two fronts, they formed this alliance with Austria-Hungary, who joined because they wanted to expand their empire, and Russia and France saw the same opportunities for the same territory. Therefore, in 1879, the dual alliance was formed between Germany and Austria-Hungary. Oh, okay. I think we're missing a country in this triple alliance. Who, who would it be? Despite Italy and Austria-Hungary being bitter rivals and involved in multiple wars with each other, Italy found their best potential ally to be with Austria-Hungary and Germany. This was in reaction to France occupying Tunis. Italy then turned to the secret treaty known as the Triple Alliance. Dun, 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 the details of the treaty, what were they? Well, the treaty was designed to be a defensive treaty, meaning that they would only go to war if they were provoked first by opposing nations. The Triple Alliance felt that they needed a defensive treaty due to growing ambitions from those surrounding European nations. Oh, okay, that makes sense. So, what about, like, the conditions of the treaty? Like, what were the, the rules and stuff? The treaty stated that if France were to attack Italy, Germany and Austria-Hungary would provide assistance in the conflict. Likewise, if France were to attack Germany, Italy and Austria-Hungary would provide assistance in that conflict as well. well that's, that's nice of them. I'd, I'd like something like that if I was a country and was afraid of war, I guess. What about the other one? Well, if Russia were to attack Austria-Hungary, Italy agreed to remain neutral. This is significant because Austrian troops would not be needed to protect the Italian-Austrian-Hungarian border. Wow, that is a lot to say. That is. That's like a... Like a, a tongue twister. <laughs> yes. Yeah. It's a tongue twister. You, like, read my mind. So, so like, what did everyone else think about this, or how did everyone else react? Well, in reaction to the formation of the Triple Alliance, France, Britain, and Russia took their own precautions and formed their own alliance, called the Triple Entente. This alliance was a friendly understanding to counterbalance the Triple Alliance. Well, okay. All right. I feel you. So, you guys, how did this alliance and you're kind of just demolish at the world's fingertip. The alliance ended when Italy formed a secret treaty with France, who was an opposing nation to the Triple Alliance. At the beginning of World War I, Germany attacked France, causing Italy to back out of the alliance that was supposed to be defensive and eventually join the Allies. <laughs> All right. So, after all this and the countries allying and things like that, all the fun stuff, what was the significance of it all? Well, World War I essentially began due to the assassination of Franz Ferdinand, which caused Austria-Hungary to become increasingly more hostile towards Russia. When Russia responded to this hostility, they decided to mobilize their forces, which then caused Germany to declare war on Russia. While acting upon this declaration of war, they attacked the Russian ally of France, which then initiated the downward spiral into World War I. Furthermore, the Triple Alliance laid the groundwork for the Central Powers to be formed. Wow, that was a lot. 
No, I really appreciate this like little history lesson y'all gave me today. You are welcome. I am. <laughs> I'm very. Thank you.